in the NFL draft. The th hey, make us lunch. We're hungry. Hey, yo, everybody, how you doing? I want to talk about the best dynamic duo never to play together, but they will this September. And that's all Sean Jeffries and Carson Wentz. In their first year together, what can we expect? What's acceptable? What do you think is a good number? I have my own opinion. What's yours? Now, last year, Carson had nobody to throw to, and he had a stinky coach who stinks. But now he's got somebody to throw to, and he's still got a stinky coach that stinks. So what does that mean? Well, I don't know, because I don't know what this coach is going to do. But when I look at the numbers, you know, what I would like to see out of Carson Wentz and out of Alshon Jeffrey, this is what I'm thinking. For Carson, I want to see between 20 and 25 touchdown passes, uh, close to 4,000 yards passing, and I want to see his interceptions go down if possible, but no worse than staying the same. So, in a, in a great case scenario, which, which would be great to me, would be like 25 touchdowns, 13 interceptions, 4,000 yards passing, something like that. If he could have a year like that, that would be unbelievable. Unbelievable. But we have to see, because like I said, who knows with this coach? I have no idea what this coach is planning. Will he even let Alshon run a deep route? I don't know. Now, I mean it. And you think I'm saying, I don't know about this coach. I think he stinks. God, I hate this. All right, anyways. Now, sorry. Now, as far as Alshon goes, I want to see Alshon have about 85 to 90 catches, something over 1,200 yards, like 13, 1,400 yards, best case scenario, I would love. And I would like to see him have like 11, 12 touchdown passes. I don't want just 10 because 10 is one way from 9. I want more than 10. I want it to be well over 10 so there's no doubt about it you know what i mean so give me all sean like 85 90 catches 1300 yards 12 touchdowns that would be awesome if we could get those kind of numbers from these two guys the rest of the offense is probably all doing better too people like zach Ertz may be playing before december you know what i mean and the running game is going to stink no matter what there's a lot of stinky parts to this team. I'm getting sick and tired of it. We gotta get rid of the stinkiness. But all Sean and Carson Wentz, they're ready to go. We gotta get them ready to go. We want Carson Wentz, 20 to 25 touchdowns, 4,000 yards around there, passing, 13, 14 interceptions at most, but no more. And then all Sean, 85, 90 catches, 1,300 yards. And 12 touchdowns. We get that. We got something there. We got something as long as we can sign all Sean to the net, you know, to a multi-year contract. If if all Sean walk, walks away, if he walks away, it, what the hell was it for? It was a waste. Peace.